A Puskás díjat 2009-ben alapították, és eddig olyanok zsebelték be a fődíjat, mint Cristiano Ronaldo, Ibrahimovic vagy Levela. Viszont itt a díjnak van egy magyar vonatkozása is, és nem csak Puskás Ferencre gondolok, hanem... Egy ollózó mozdulat! Hanem Zsúri Danira, aki a DVSC FTC mérkőzéssel lőtte meg ezt az óriási mozdulatot, és ha már DVSC, szokásosan itt vagyunk a DVSC edzőközpontjában. 2022-ben a díjat egyesítették, most már nem csak a férfiak kaphatják, hanem a nők is, illetve a parasportolók is. Jusztes Pajé és Richelison elől hapolt el a trófát, és itt is egy ollózó mozdulattal verte be az ellenfél kapujával a labdát. Annyi különbsége, hogy nem igazán variálhatott, hogy ballal vagy jobban lövi, mert egy lába van. Ebben a videóban pedig megpróbáljuk rekreálni, mennyire is nehéz megcsinálni ezt a puskás díjas találatot. Itt van velünk egy parasportoló, ő fog nekünk segíteni, megmutatja a technikát, aztán pedig mi következünk. Gyertek, nem gondolom, srácok! I'm Stefan Logaro, I am 18 years old and I'm playing football from 8 years now. Main focus is on football because I like it, I also love to play tech ball. Five years from now I want to play professional amputee football and uh, for tech ball I want to prepare for maybe 2028 Los Angeles Olympics. I'd like to, to achieve that. What do you think, how many tries would you need to score this goal? Probably less than 10, I hope. Ooh, that's spicy, let's see, let's see, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it it, it was okay, higher. yeah, it, yeah. It, it has to be higher, <laughs> but yeah. for the first try, it was my fault. <laughs> There's only one Zlatan. <laughs> kettő próbánk volt, kettő per kettőt bevert a srác. Ez mi? Okay, I will try to give it higher. <laughs> Higher, higher. <laughs> oh, the wind! Yeah. No way. The wind. Yes! Should be there. Megkockáztatom, hogy a pass nehezebb az, mint a mozdulat. De komolyan, mert arra adott, de neki arra az oldalra kell. No! No way! <laughs> Na hát kb. szerintem olyan 20 perce próbálkozunk a lövéssel, ami szerintem annyira nem sok. Szél nagyon megnehezíti, illetve nekem baladóként az nagyon nagy nehézség, hogy elég közel állok Stefanhoz, viszont egy íves labdát kell nekem adni. And for the shoot the hard part is to hit it where Martin did it, in that corner, not here, because here it's easier for us. We can do it. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> it was really good. Ah. <laughs> Viszont perc alatt körülbelül sikerült meglőnünk ezt a gólt. Szerintem nagyon jó másolata volt az eredeti gólnak. Beadni is nehéz volt, de hát biztos, hogy Stefannak volt a legnehezebb dolga. So Stefan, like how often do you use this kind of kick in a, in a real match? Actually, to now I, I use it like 10 times and it was perfectly. Oh. Everyone was wow, <laughs> no way. So Stefan, now it's our turn to try this shot. Can you give yeah. us some advice? what to do like you never <laughs> done this before yeah first advice is to make it higher because you are higher than me oh okay so okay. you can adjust your yeah i can adjust it and uh, i don't know you need power in hands and actually not that that hard but you need to try it's a regular bicycle kick just with the... yeah it's like a bicycle yeah. kick so i should have to i tried it without crutches yes yeah. it is the same like bicycle kick You tried it without the clutches. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Innentől nincs annyira kifogás, hogyha megcsinálta a botok nélkül, akkor mi valahogy megcsináljuk a botokkal. Let's go. Yeah. When you, when you want to hit, you need to do this move. Like, yeah, Bro, lean back like, a little. Like, <laughs> I see, I see, I see. Like, the ball is coming. I'm like... Yeah, like oh. this, like this, yeah. Látod azt? But, yeah, but, but uh, lift up your left foot. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> the ball is going, going. I'm like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Both hands. 
I used both hands. <gül> első próba, figyelj! Elsőre! Lát föl! Gyere, Zesó, gyere! Szabadon vagyok, gyere, gyere! Az jó! Te a labda jó volt! Azt láttam! Csak rá kell érezni, az, az jó! El fog törni a kezedbe valami! Bocs! Tesó! Nem rossz! Assist, assist mester. Ahhoz képest nem rossz. Köszönöm. How do you get the ball up, so? Hadd próbáljam már ki én is. De furcsa. Még azt mondom, hogy labdát vezetni, oké, okay, bazd meg, de felhúzni a labdát, hát hülye, még sehogy, sehogy nem tudsz. Meg tök máshol van a súlyfontból. So, huge respect for you. It's, it's really hard. Oh my god! Lippi, mondj egy pár szót erről. Szerintem az lehetetlen. Wait a minute! Az, az a bajom, hogy én úgy tudom, hogy kb. amúgy csak így tudsz lőni bottal. Hát de... Hát, hát jó, hát, próbáld már ki! Oh. Over. Stefan, glad you are here. Thank you for accepting our invitation. Do you think about like the scene of amputated football? Regular people appreciate it enough, or maybe it should be more highlighted? In some countries, it's really loved by all the people, not just in crutches. Like in Turkey and England, they have fans. They have a lot of people on stadiums. They have professional leagues, and they are paid for playing. But in not many countries, like I said, in Turkey and England. Yeah. So we need to to show the people what amputated football uh, is. Can you make a living by amputated football in these countries? Uh, I'm not sure, but I know something that in Turkey you can do it because they have actually five leagues, five wow. leagues to play. That's so interesting. And probably in the first league you are paid for playing and you can live. Who is your favorite player in football? You can say uh, normal football, amputated football, it's up to you. <laughs> normal one, one. football is Antoine Griezmann. Oh, because I love that's, that's, that's my man, that's my <laughs> In Amputee football, I met some in uh, some players in table competition like Liam Burbridge or Jamie Olki and Jamie Tregaskis. They are so good players. Are you raise awareness or maybe these older players try to raise awareness through social media to amputated football? Yes, I try to meet some uh, football players, not Amputee football, learn to show them what is it. Maybe they want to get in, get involved in this, but in Romania it's hard. Like in Western Europe, it's hard to do this. And one more thing, what do you think about today? How hard was the goal? <laughs> <laughs> it was a bit hard, harder than I expected, yeah. because when I played and I made it in football, I didn't expect that, I didn't want it to do that. It was naturally, and uh, it seemed not that hard, but now when we tried it, it was a bit hard, but it's good that we made it. Thank you, Stefan. Thank you. It was amazing to work with you. Thank you. Thank you.